the first is a father, and we're not rushing him, but a father's perspective is important. Say hello to Wes. Good morning. The winds of change are blowing, are they not? I stand before you this morning as a concerned citizen. I stand before you this morning as a mad father. I am mad that Common Core has come down squarely on the shoulders of my daughter. I am tired of it. But just because I'm tired of it, I do realize that there is big money and big business tied into this. And I do realize that any time government and big business meet, that the common man, the voter, the little man, the average Joe has a hard time being heard. I'm here today to be heard. Yeah. Let me take just one moment to briefly address Commissioner Huffman on something. Make no mistake about it. I am not false. I am not fake. I am not a faux parent when it comes to defending my child. You know, across this state, we have all kinds of rights. Last year, they passed a, right, passed a bill that said we can carry a gun in a bar under the right conditions. We defend all our rights, do we not? So why does my right stop at the door of my child's school? Why can I not have the right to see what kinds of tests she takes? Why can I not have the right to decide whether or not she will take those tests? We will be heard here. And I stand here asking that our legislatures continue to hear our voices. Continue speaking up, continue fighting the good fight, because we're all in it together, and we will stop Common Core. Yeah.